What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to G Myers World. And right now, we're going to be talking about how you can get a free 90 overall Adrian Peterson and Madden 24 Ultimate Team. And the first thing that you're going to want to do is make sure you go back, sit, relax, like the video, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. We're going to jump right into it. Uh, pretty much what EA Sports did, right? In the first season, they made the Legend Packs just automatically open. All right. In this season right now, you can actually have the pack stationary in the competitive pass. So if you guys have been keeping up with everything that's been going on, you guys should have known right now, like today is the day. All right. He's in packs right now. So as long as the legends and every, uh, the limiteds uh, as legends or whatever it is are in packs, that's the time for you guys to actually go after it. So I'm going to show you guys right now what's going on. At level 27, when you get this pack, it will not automatically open. So we're going to have the opportunity right now to go ahead and do it. If we don't do it, it is what it is, but we should still be able to put together enough to get that Adrian Peterson. These are the type of free things that you get as you go through the field pass. I know it's strenuous. I know it's crazy. But, bro, I'm telling you, these are very, very much worth it. We're going to find out now, though, if they do update the actual pack. Because one of the things that EA Sports does is sometimes they don't update for the new cards. So it's like, you know, it's predated to when you actually got the pack. But we're going to find out about that as well um, as we go through the video. Also with the challenges, Michael Strahan is also available. But I do want to point this out, right? With the way that this is set up, by next week, you're going to be able to get a free legend. Will Shield and Michael Strahan are the other cards. They're not limited. So we're, we're specifically like trying to rely on the pack to see if there's a chance that EA will do us right. Other than that, we'll get a random 90 from before, and it'll be kind of stupid. So we have to kind of figure out exactly how this is going to work. But you want to get this done because this is going to give you one more token. And next week, you're going to be eligible to get a free legend regardless. And that's going to probably net you about 500K. Now, one of the notes that I want to point out with the set, it tells you season one with the legends, right? So we got to be very, very careful with that situation because if we're going to get a season one legend, we won't be eligible for the other legends. So you can see what it says, right? Season one, we're going to have to reach out to EA Sports. I'm going to be going ahead and making a post on X. So make sure you guys are following me over there to go ahead and read, you know, repost it and like it and stuff like that because they shouldn't make it so it's only from season one. That doesn't appear to be much, you know, it doesn't appear to be fair. It should be any legend. You know what I'm saying, bro? Like, I don't know what EA Sports is doing, but a lot of these things aren't planned out. It is a possibility. It is one week away. It's a chance that we may be able to throw some season two players in there. All right. So now let's go ahead and open the pack that I was talking about uh, from the um, competitive pass and see what EA Sports has in store for us real quick. All right. Because EA is about to do us real dirty. We also got the Star Elite pack as well. Um from the regular field pass. So as long as you've been grinding, there's always a chance for you guys to get the free content. Now look, this is what I was talking about. You see how they're giving like these outdated legend stuff like that? That's with the season one stuff. That can really, really be negative for a lot of us that are working to get these free packs from the competitive pass. So, you know, like I said, follow me on X and uh, at G Myers World, and we're gonna go ahead and make a post to EA. Like, listen, we, we, you know, we should be able to get a 90 overall legend from season two as well. All right, so let's go ahead and open this pack up and let's see what EA Sports has in store for us. What they got, EA? What they got, what they got, EA? Okay, so Darrell Revis is not that bad. All right, I'm gonna tell you this right now. It's free, it's not that bad. So we're not gonna really go crazy uh, with this whole situation. Now, the one thing that I'm gonna have to check, if you guys are opening those packs and you got that pack yesterday and not the day of, or after they release the Adrian Peterson, I need you guys to reach out to me and let me know what the deal is. Because ultimately, we got to know if these other uh, legends are available inside of that pack, if you got it before. Because if they, if they do the right thing and it's updated, that's actually huge. So right here where we are, you can see that Adrian Peterson's card is about 998, right? So that's the average. So as people are pulling the cards, it's a chance that it'll keep coming down. We just want to grab his card. So the 90 overall that we got, we're going to just go ahead and sell it right now. You see what I'm saying? And see what we can do with it. Because we don't want Darrell Revis. Like, we've already tried him out. He's too undersized, and dudes are going to throw the ball right at your user, and it's going to be real nasty. So he's about, you know, 522. So we're going to put him up for 499. All right? Because, like, this is the way that you have to work the market as well if you're trying to get the newer cards. Now... We also can go through the set route for Michael Strahan and Will Shields as well 
because we've been accumulating cards in that regard. But somebody will snatch this guy up for 499 because if we put it up for 500, it really just is something about like when you put it over the amount. Like if, if he's at 522 and we want to get him, you know, get rid of him right now, 499, because it's not with the five, they usually sell automatically. So you just put it down underneath and people think it's a real deal. But when you look at the tax and everything else that comes with it, it really isn't though. Now, also keep in mind, right? Walter Payton is our starting running back right now, all right? I want you guys to make sure you're paying attention to that because I know you guys are like, yo, G, so how are you going to do the rest because you weren't able to get him out of your pack for free? How do you work it? So we always have reserve cards, right? And um, what we try to do is we make sure that we can make up for it. You see how fast he sold? So we can make up the million right now. Also, you see that we have 79,000 treats. You're going to want to subscribe because I got a lot of information about how all those treats are coming together. And we're going to be going crazy inside the market uh, once they um, update uh, part three for most feared. So you guys are going to want to subscribe and make sure you have your alerts turned on because I got some really good info on that. But anyway, we're at 915, right? So think about it like this. If you opened up that pack and you didn't get the card that you wanted for free and you actually want that Adrian Peterson, he also comes with that new X Factor for zero AP where he gets like evasive and a bunch of weird stuff. So he's gonna be a card that people are gonna wanna try out because he has that Legend X uh, X Factor, which I definitely wanna try out for myself. But I do have a feeling that he's going to continue to come down. Now, around 900K, something like that, that'll work. More than likely, right, if we get him and he's not really what we thought he was, we won't lose too much off of him because of that X Factor because you're gonna save regular AP and be able to put that AP someplace else and probably make your team a lot better. So with that, in that situation, I would definitely watch that. Now, as far as Michael Strahan, um, we could definitely add an addition to him. If you guys were looking to get him for free, obviously we could have just swapped him and um, you know Darrell Revis. So if you do exactly what I'm telling you and grind the comp pass, you're gonna get a free legend. But I think most of us are looking for the Adrian Peterson. All right? so. With the way that everything is going right now at the height of the market, obviously his price is going to drop to 900K, right? So because of the fact that I want to grab him now so I can show you guys everything, as far as like everything that's going on, we could probably buy him for like a million and change right now and just sell another card, which is what I would recommend that you guys do if that's something that you're looking to do right now. You could also use some of your treats inside of the store and, you know, sell something there. But again, for the purposes of the video, uh, we're going to go ahead and see if we can sell something right now that has a little bit of value. I don't want to sell Walter Payton, though. You know what I'm saying, bro? Because I would actually, I might have to sell him. Actually, but I, I definitely love the way he runs and all that stuff. But I think he, what is he, at 89 speed? Yeah. All right. So look, this is what we'll do. We'll get rid of him because he's going to be at least like 140. And then we could just upgrade, you know, pretty much to um, Adrian Peterson. Like, Oh, he's at 173. All right. So we'll go... 165 right just to kind of see if somebody will buy him right now and we'll be able to go ahead and grab ap and like pretty much show you what's going on but like i said you see the way that my coin stack was and because of that free pack we were able to do that that's why it's very important like i said always have something chilling in the back burner dude just always have something chilling all right so right now with the way that they have it set if we can snag ap we, he sold instantly because like honestly walter payton is one of the best backs in the game like that dude, that dude, is a, he doesn't even need abilities. Like just so you guys know, if, if you're just trying to figure out like, yo, gee, what's the best running back? Walter Payton's right there and he's a budget beast. So I would definitely say, yo, go grab that dude. You know what I'm saying? For those kind of prices, because he's going to burn dudes regardless. So they're at 1.09. All right. What are the chances that we keep coming back here and somebody puts them up for cheaper? You know, it's a very, it, it's highly, it's highly likely that somebody else is gonna post them for the 1.05 or something like that. Um, one of the things, like I said, when you're actually doing this is having patience. So what I'm going to do is, I'm gonna let you guys know, I'm gonna get this card, right? I may end up getting them for cheaper. I just thought it was very, very important to show you guys the way that you go through it with the blueprint. And if you wanna sell other cards, see how it's coming down a little bit, 1.07. Um, you wanna make sure that you sell off the card, obviously, as long as it's not part of your theme team which is why Bo Jackson is still there because we have a Raiders theme team. So we have to kind of watch it and you can see where it's going. So I'm going to leave this here, right? And then you guys are going to know that I'm going to get that AP and I'm going to be giving you guys gameplay live on Twitch. And you guys need to go ahead and follow me on Twitch too. 
uh, at Gmiles World. All right, guys, let me know what you pulled out of that pack. Did you get AP? And let me know if you like them. Post, send me a post on, uh, okay, right there. Right there, dude. Okay, somebody bought them instantly. Got, bro, we didn't move fast enough. Chat, we didn't move fast enough right there. I was just about to get up out of here. We didn't move fast enough right there for that. Because people are going to put them up for one mil. Uh, people might put them up for 900K. Depending on what kind of teams people are working with, this is all you do. You go to the catalog, you keep backing out, you keep going back in. Somebody's going to put them up for cheap. Like I said, I think we'll get them for like 900K. We're not even tripping, bro. We almost snagged them right there. That would have been pretty cool for the video, but it didn't work out that way. And they're right above our 1 million plus. So it's oh, right there again. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Did we snag them? All right, we got them. All right, good. So now the video is extended. If you left already, yo, GG's. If you're still here, write AP in the comments. All right, so look, right here, we're going to just go ahead and show you guys his numbers. This card is ridiculous. You see the numbers, dude. What is this? What is this change in direction? What's his COD? 92? God, yeah, bro. He about to go crazy. So look, this is what I was talking about, right? These, these X factors, the evasive, that's going to be probably really, really OP. All right, with the juke moves. I don't care about the backfield master. Um, you know, I, I'm not concerned about that. I think we're going to get him and we're going to throw this on him. And that's going to open up more because we were running jukebox on, um, on uh, Walter Payton. Now this opens up a lot more as far as Adrian Peterson goes. And like I said, he's super fast. He's the fastest back in the game. He's probably gonna be able to truck too and have a mean stiff arm, no? Where's his stiff arm at? Uh, jump, okay, so stiff arm should be down here someplace. Where, dude, his stiff arm gotta be crazy. Stiff arm 87, it should be like 99. That dude was punching dude straight in the face. So anyway, that's where we are right now. Let me know if you stayed for the whole video by writing AP. Other than that, I'm gonna see you guys and girls next time. Happy hunting, bros. See you guys soon. One love, y'all.